You know the fire pit, you know the outer oven. And now I made a new accessory. It's called the barbecue kit. And today we're just gonna experiment a little bit. Oh wait, let me tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna make fish with tomato sauce. Charcoal, baby! Oh, it's gonna be too good. Hmm. And then I just put this super handy chimney above it. It's not, it looks cool, but it doesn't. Pop, 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 pop. Bit of salt. It's commercial time now. So you see this grill grate? This is super thick stainless steel. Six millimeters will last you a lifetime. It's in the web shop now www.stetlermate.com Check it, Cedric put it in the edit. <laughs> the tomatoes are nice and mushy. I'm gonna take them off. Nice. I've just decided something popped up in my brain. So these tomatoes are the beauties. These tomatoes are gonna be the sauce tomato. Squash them and leave them on the fire for a little bit longer. I designed this in a way that uh, it's not perfectly straight. Put it in a slope of one degree so even when you put a heavy pot on there flush okay enough bragging we need a little bit of spice uh -huh. mm. Mm -mm. wow it's like candy trout so you see that skin is super slimy and wet and if you put that on the grill you won't cook the skin but you, the energy will just go in evaporating that moisture and that sticky skin that will get stuck to your grill grate so you want to make this super dry on the outside and on the inside <laughs> Bit of salt on the outside uh. Swim, my little friend. Him. Hi. Yes. That's what we want. Hmm. I think that's perfect. Mm. Look at that crispy skin on there. Normally I cook for the whole crew. Everybody's on holiday. I'm the only one here together with Cedric, my vegetarian cameraman. So I'm afraid I gotta do this one by myself. Uh, thanks for watching. See you next time. It's so good. crazy.